Hey, it's Jeremy. Welcome back to Fire Emblem Engage. This is episode 28, and we are on the retreat. We have defeated the guards, and now we're we're gonna do some dumb shit, <laughs> and we're gonna try we're gonna try some dumb shit where we try to um where we try to take the hounds in Thanks. like in rapid succession as they come in on us we're gonna try to hit them real fucking hard and and see how that goes i have no fucking clue if it's even possible uh but it does seem like a really good time so we're gonna we're gonna give it a go it looks as if Marnie and uh, what's the other one? Lethia or something like that are going to be way out in front. So Marnie is a problem because she has 26 fucking defense and, you know, can reach all of the things in existence. Okay, we care about these two. Um, Zephia is a problem because she's a fucking problem. But it does seem as if, right, like, Gris, super far behind. The fucking Corrupted Worms, super far behind. If we could potentially pop Marnie really, really quickly. We have Alchrist. We have Etie, right? Like, in theory, we can drop the both of them... Um, almost instantaneously. Zephia has the ability to do magic attack that is 28 damage. Marnie can hit for 25. Also magic attack. <laughs> what? Fucking magic attack does she have? The hurricane axe is a magic attack. Yeah, a magical axe. Okay. Hit chance, hit chance. Okay, this is going to be really weird. We're going to try to bait with Yunaka. First off, Yunaka's gonna kill this guy. Was that too much? Try that. Here I go. Uh, thanks. Okay. Five point level up. Plus one magic, plus one speed, plus one defense, plus one resistance, and plus one luck on Jean. Okay. Um, I think... Yeah. I mean, Zelkov has just as much of an opportunity of dodging this shit as other people do. So, fuck. Put him in the woods as well. Well, I, I'm assuming someone's going to die immediately right now. He's going to come in. He has a zero chance. Get out of my face. Perfect. This is what we want. 
These two, however, are not going to have zero oh, chances. Poor thing. Sorry you lost your little friends. Want me to make it better? Twenty-two. <laughs> Fuck. Hit me with the twenty-two, but didn't kill me. <laughs> you? Is this the best they can do? This be a sitch. Zero percent chance to hit me, but we can't damage them either. Okay. Ooh, and walked away. Interesting. Okay. So. Part of what we potentially need to do is we need to not only kill Zephia, but we need to... I don't think we can kill Marnie in a single turn, but we might be able to control Marnie with someone like Yunaka and Zelkov. Now the issue is, is this guy coming in and killing as well, right? So, um, big, big scenarios is going to be, can Etie, can Alchrist kill Zephia? Can they do 36 damage? I don't know if they can do 36 damage. Um, who can be involved in what? Anna cannot be involved in anything. Um... Bram can't really be involved. I think we probably kill her bow. We probably bow, 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 right? Bow, 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 bow. What? Hold up. I thought that was a hundred percent chance. Was that not a hundred percent chance? That's a forty-eight percent chance. <laughs> Yo, I was looking nowhere is where I was fucking looking. We have a shit chance to hit with all of these. Sixty-eight percent chance. That is not great. We do do 36 damage. We have a 68% chance to do 36 damage. So it is possible to one-shot her. 31 here. 71 there. Okay. Let's see if we can hit the 63 here. Hmm. Yikes. Big yikes. Big oofs. Um, hmm. Hum, 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 hum. They're definitely not making it easy, eh? We go in, we attack with an iron lance and break her. We have to 50 we have a 50% chance of hitting. We'll see. We're really not getting any of those over 50s that we need. I regret. Seems um seems like the game is telling us no.
fucking Roy shit. <laughs> Annoying. We're gonna see if Etier can hit with a steel, with a iron bow. We want to try to kill one of the HP pips. Pretty weak. One down. Four point level up. HP, strength, dex, and resistance on Etier. Very nice. Okay. Now, does that change our? chances here. 73% chance. Cool. I challenge my fate. This is it. Okay. I had to stop. Does that change our shit enough to get a killer bow? Forty-eight percent chance, probably not. Allow me. Almost. Almost. Uh, I think that probably does it for us, if that's the case. Not being able to seal the deal on that is a big issue for us. Um. Give me an order. for me. <laughs> Big help. I think at this point it's just very likely someone's dying. That rapier is a problem. Zero percent chance Many to hit. Contempt. Oh, nice crit. Insta kill. Such Hell yeah. ephemeral life. Velkov's so dramatic. All right, Zephyr went for a double. So that's a thing. I find easy victories dissatisfying. Attack me with all your might. Mavier is going for Zelkov, who I'm assuming he's probably not going to be able to hit. 11% chance. That's interesting. Is going for the real Ivy. 
60% chance missed. Hold up. Wait a minute. <laughs> Things just became possible again. Oh no. Uh, can we hit her? 89% chance. 89% uh, chance to kill. Zephy is down. Strong. And I was being so nice. How cruel. I'll be sure to tell Lady Vale about this. Yo. <laughs> I am excite bike. Yo, six point level up for Alcris, plus one HP, plus one dex, plus one speed, plus one defense, plus one resistance, and plus one luck. Hell fucking yeah, my boy. My boy indeed. All right, and Marnie has... Unfortunately, Marnie has gone really far away to the other side, so it's going to be harder for us to take Marnie out. Um, But Marnie is very killable from Ivy. Uh, in point of fact, Ivy needs to, to chill and do some other stuff, because Ivy can do... Okay. Can't do anything there. Can't do anything there. Noble Rapier can do 12... Can't, can't even get hit. Um, okay, so... A little bit of a situation. We're kind of just running on luck at this point, basically. Whatever you need. Fine spirit, hell yeah. I'm gonna check something real quick, actually. Can we... Can we leave right now? No. We cannot leave right now. It has to be the Divine Dragon leaving, so it, it can't just be anybody. Hell yeah. Unforgivable. All right. Uh, yeah. Seventeen twice. We need to get her the fuck away. We might actually need to start trying to be a little more defensive. Now that Mavier is here. 80% chance to hit her actually is a big fucking deal. Um, that's a problem.
Bram has a lot of resistance, so she might be able to take a hit from both Mavier and from Marnie. Oh, this guy's in range to sell like a we're toast. I think. I think we're toast. And Celica. I'll make it hurt real good. Oh uh, shite. Try to do the same for me, yeah. 14 damage. Rejoice. Coming in. Ooh, that hurt. That hurt a lot, but he did just put himself right in all of us. If we don't die here, that's a 48%. No, 60% chance. Yeah, I Fuck. I must withdraw from fighting. I cannot die before my kingdom's throne is restored. Fuck. A 60% chance got us. Anything we think we can do... I don't... I don't really know that there's anything that we can do in that scenario. Maybe uh, we could... Instead of... Staff, obstruct, here. Does that work? Does that, is that gonna work? Okay, we'll see. We're gonna, we're gonna see. Shenanigans over here. Can we block Marnie from being able to get to... Um, Gris is still gonna come in. Fine, whatever. 14 damage to Ivy and Lynn. But can we prevent Marnie from getting to Ivy? Comes in on Diamant. Hurts like fucking hell. But. Goes in on Etienne. Yo! That is huge all right we're fucking back in it boys uh can we kill marnie without really getting got here i will endure i don't know okay marnie is now a problem because marnie's in the middle of everybody um Part of, the, part of the problem here is she got so far away from us that we're actually going to have an issue killing her. Our other magic attacker is now too far away. We can steel bow this guy. 100% chance he drops. I'll apologize later. Mavier is going down you like a bitch. Here. It feels like.
I won't flinch. That's a problem. Okay, we take this guy down here. Was that sufficient? We see if we maybe we can contain Marnie. Uh, Louis gains plus one HP, plus one dex, plus one defense, and plus one build. Okay. Inaka comes here to hopefully crit this guy. 1% chance to crit. Fuck. Probably not. Um, he does have a 65% chance to hit. Not great. Move there. Okay. We can move here and just hold. We can move here. Staff, heal. We can. Move here. Attack. 5% chance to hit us. Drop your guard. Alas. Brit, get the fuck out of my face. I underestimated you. If we have another chance, let us do battle again. My god, I'm into this. Easy peasy indeed. Three point level up. Uh, plus one speed, plus one defense, and plus one luck. Hell yeah. Uh, Kagetsu can actually hurt. Oh, no, she can't. She can, she can, uh... Chain attack. We just wait, right? We just move in and we hold. Um, it's starting to wear on me. Etia gets the fuck out of the way. And actually, like, Riss, I don't think is super duper scary. Attack, L fire. He does do 20 fucking damage, never fucking mind. We try to pull back. I mean, we still have noble rapier fucking opportunities here. I feel like he can't even kill us even if he hits now and hits in a second. So I feel like we totally take the opportunity to pop. Twenty nine percent chance to hit. He did want to get cut. Let's fucking give him his wish. Big miss. Fritz. There's a fucking health bar, my dude. Hell yeah. He's not gonna kill in a single turn, I would hope. So we heal Ivy. I hear you. I kind of actually feel like we need to move off over here and see if we can make sure we're in range for Marnie this turn. Those boyos coming in hot is, is a little scary. Can he just dark warp repeatedly? <laughs> Alright, fuck you game. That's bullshit. Uh, I'm happy he decided to dark warp her though. Hurricane Lance is going to Absolutely demolish Lewis, but 
Doesn't matter, right? Like, irrelevant. Uh, Elfire, Marnie's down. From me to you. Uh, what fun! Uh, yeah. Beaten by a Fuck bunch yes. of weaklings. <laughs> You're stronger than you look. I'm gonna remember your face. Oh, shite. Plan levels up. HP, deck speed, and resistance. No, you died? Fuck you. <laughs> no. No, no dying here. Okay. You know how this works. Okay, so we definitely have to... We have problems. We have to make sure that I'm still people are... Healed. Um, in point of fact, this is actually like a really dangerous situation. Still with Gris, since Gris can just fucking warp Ragnarok repeatedly, right? Like it. This is a problem. My muscles say thanks. Damn. He is busy on that one. I will not dig this grave. Was that in question? Are we are we in the habit of just digging graves for other people? Okay, so here's the thing. If if we do not engage Chris. I don't think he can warp Ragnarok kill any single person on a singular turn. As long as they are full health or close to full health. Right? So... Ooh. 66% chance? No. Not, not worth it. Absolutely. So I think... I'm ready. I think we might be able to bait. Big boy's incoming. 14 damage. He's really focused on Ivy and Lin. That's fine. A really bad target for him. Eighty percent chance, pretty solid. We'll go for this. That. I need to be more diligent. Good job, Jean. Four point level up, plus one strength, plus one magic, plus one speed, plus one resistance. Not too bad. And then whatever you say. Lace into this guy. First one, three. Oh, oh yeah. You might be enjoying it a bit too much. From me to you. Precision and power. Oh my god, it's so cool! <laughs> that was great! That felt good. But that good was enough. fucking <laughs> Don't you say fuck off, Jay. That was perfect. That was so fucking good. <laughs> <laughs> Holy fuck. Absolutely a so anime. So fucking anime. That was great. And I I reaffirm my belief that Kagetsu is super Mitch's style. Mm-hmm. Yo. 
my death. peeps. We have defeated the hounds. The issue is, is I don't think, I, I don't think we can defeat, uh, I don't think we can defeat Vale without losing someone. I just, like, diffused healer. When unit is healed by a staff, all adjacent allies also recover 50% of the HP that the unit recovered. Wow. Cool. Also, yeah, for for clarity, this is these things are a problem. Okay, in point of fact, we are going to save right here because we can get to the retreat point this turn. Um, we have safety this turn. We're going to... Uh, we're going to try to gear up. We're going to try to set up to destroy these guys as soon as they come in. We're going to have to Nova Your them with fucking please. everything that we have. Oh. These things are... plotting. They only have two... Yikes. They're a problem. ignores attack and defense or ignores uh, defense and whatchamacallit, right? Like, they're a fucking problem. Yeah, big help. Yikes. And they only move two, so we can't really bait them in. I don't know. I don't know if we can beat these guys at all. Um, I guess maybe one of the opportunities is just no mistakes. Don't let them hit us. Right, like fucking easier said than done. But we can put Zelkov there and just be like, okay, they're he's gonna march forward too, and then we swarm him. Cross our fingers, I suppose. Zero percent chance to hit Zelkov. Go ahead. They do counter. The <laughs> oh god. Do they counter every time? Because that's a little bullshit. But if they literally can't hit Zelkov or um, if they can't hit Zelkov or uh, Yukana or y Yukana? Yakuna? Yukana. My brain's dying. Yunaka. My god. Could not compute. If they can't hit either of them, right, then this is a, a moot point. They don't... They don't get a fucking option if they can't hit either of them. So we can just... We can just chip them the fuck down. <laughs> There's an answer for everything, my boy. Get out. Get on out of here. <laughs> you 
You're dead. Yo, nice crit. Fucking disgusting. I am so I'm reveling in the in these moments. No. I love strategy life. games because they're like puzzles, right? Like there are these little puzzles that if you just figure out the right unit in the right position, you solve the puzzle. HP plus one, luck plus one, bad level up for Zelkov, but you know what? Don't fucking care. We'll fucking take it. Alright, that guy is moving slowly downwards, which is a little bit of a pain in the ass. Yeah, absolutely bragging rights, 1,000%. I mean, I'm also, I've also been getting a lot of experience out of this, actually. So, there is a little more than bragging rights, but it's, it's 900% bragging rights. How are our chances out in the... Ooh, 57% chance if we go... No, it's not on hard anymore. We did we did drop the difficulty. The The thing about hard was it, it just started to get to the point to where it was like, we could do it, but I was like, this is just going to be long and frustrating. I don't... Like, doing this on hard, I obviously is doable. I think, I think most games would be designed with a scenario of like, oh, this is going to be doable. But doing this on hard, I think you would absolutely have to be prepared to sacrifice units. Unless you had already just like super leveled a couple of units. Yeah, we're not, we're not attacking. We're not moving out of the fucking uh, woods. Because the woods are what makes it to where we can guarantee dodge. But we are running into a little bit of an annoying issue. But back in range. Oh, yeah. Dragon's dead, yo. Corrupted worms down. Only enemy left is Veil. I wonder if she says anything. I wonder if anything is going to happen now. Ugh, two point level up. The game's like, look, fuck you. <laughs> HP and Dex. No, no nothing from Vale. She hits for 42 fucking magic damage. Is it even possible for us to... I mean, yeah, we can tank a hit. <laughs> We got 14 defense, 23 resistance. What's her ability? Adjacent allies deal plus one damage and take three less damage? Probably not. I I don't think we can do this part of the thing without um without losing someone. But we're fucking gonna try. We're absolutely gonna try. Um It's going to be 3,000 years. Actually, I wonder if we can just auto battle. Yeah, let's just let's just save us a little bit of clicking and auto battle to get the fuck up there. fuck
Well, that's a little bit of a problem. Charged right to the side. It seems like they're trying to stay around the main character. Except for the ones that are far enough ahead and actually listening to orders. Which is really weird. But it's gonna it's gonna save us a little bit of Oh hey, we pulled back. Hell yeah. Nice. Perfect. We'll stick with Protect for now. So hopefully that'll move everyone in an orderly fashion around Starlight. We're learning strats, fellas. We're learning strats. Oh, I'm trying to think. How do we... Can we maybe... Can we maybe dodge engage her, right? Like, is that an option? She doesn't have any trees around her as part of the thing. She has 126 hits, so probably not. Chain guard, potentially, could be used. It also depends on whether or not she behaves like a classic Fire Emblem boss, or whether she breaks and comes out of her um, of her location, right? Like, if she, once we engage her, if she comes the fuck out, right? Like... I, I mean, I would assume she's going to come the fuck out and beat ass, right? Absolutely. But no fucking idea, because we've had some enemies be like, yo, we're cool. And then other enemies be like, nah, dog, you done fucked up, right? So really interested there. We also have, I will say, we have two key adepts, right? So we can potentially break her twice if the game will let us do that. Um, so we can potentially make it to where she can't counterattack. That might not matter, though. <laughs> so I think the scenario will be, can we stack people around her, right, that can make it to where she can't hurt them? Um, or, or not make it to where she can't beat them right in in a single turn because if we can attack her and break her and then survive the counter attack then we're golden right One, two, three, four, five. We're going to actually move here with Fram. This fucking game, what are we doing? What are we doing? Oh, God. Okay, where Fram is... No! Game! Oh, rude! We cannot hurt fail. We just can't. 
the game, the game pulled the fast one on us and said, no, you, you, we will not allow it. You just fucking can't. Oh, feels bad, man. Feels absolutely bad. Hmm. I don't like that. I don't like that. You let us, you let us, let us do the whole thing, game, and then you actually just robbed us at the end there. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. Well, I mean, I guess uh, if that's the case, we can just. Well, it's gonna be it's gonna be pretty quick to just run back. <gasps> oh, Lippo's playing in a bag. That's a that's a solid sad right there. That's a solid sad right the fuck there. Damn, Odie. Damn. Damn, Otis. We were getting strategies, right? Like, I was sitting here thinking, like, look, uh, Fram gets momentum, so she'll come in swinging real hard. She can break Vale, um, and Vale only has 14 defense, so Fram coming in with a full momentum charge swing is actually probably going to do a fair amount of damage. And then we've got one, two, three, four, five, ra six ranged attackers, actually. So we can fill up every slot. One, two, three, four, five, and actually six because we can put ETA three away, right? So we could use every ranged attacker on her um, when she's broken. If I think break stays through a life bar, but if it didn't, we could come back in and we could swing with Jean, right? To break her again, if need be. Man, I was coming up with all these fucking things. I, I don't think it would have mattered. I think she would have killed someone. But still, I feel robbed. I feel robbed. Back in L, Mike. We did some fucking work there, though. I I do feel pretty fucking triumphant on the fact that Come we on, defeated the hounds. We beat the dragons. That was pretty fucking stellar. <laughs> Hell yeah, Yunaka. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Love it. Fucking love it. What are you? You're just staring down the hallway. We can travel after to Seoul through this Lippo. forest. Okay. I hate to abandon Hortensia, but staying in the kingdom is not an option. There's too much we're leaving behind. <sighs> Father, it's painful, but we can't turn back. We'd lose everything. I will lead the way. <sighs> I failed you, Martha. I failed you all. Let's actually, like, yeah, you really did fail so, us all. Ivy was scheming against us. The Gist of the Gs, thank you very much. Absolutely, though, like, the Divine Dragon just legitimately super hard failed everyone. She got pickpocketed. This whole situation might not have happened if she hadn't gotten pickpocketed. Really? I mean, granted, Vale, Vale is like some crazy shenaniganry. Zero damage ass taking ass bitch over she here. She stole two emblems from right under my nose. But. How irksome. Regardless, the advantage is mine. I have all of the rings they gathered. You shall all be destroyed. I will gut your allies, burn down your countries. And crush your spirits. This is what I was expecting. When we were seeing the veil prior to this, I was like, yeah, she's our long lost sister. She's Sombron's daughter. She's veil gonna be evil. Daughter. There's gonna be some dual and personality now she thing. Has our emblem rings. Seems like everything is uh I'm sorry, checked everyone. out. 
I should never have brought us to the cathedral. It's not your fault, Divine One. I should apologize. I asked you to let me fight. I was so angry about what they'd done. What about me? I'm the one who wanted to return Father to Brodia. That was illogical. Excuse me? If you hadn't gotten in the way... Calm down, everyone. We're on the same side. No, we're not. If not for her, we might have made it in time. We might have saved him. All Crest. Princess Ivy told us about the ritual in the first place. Without our help, Father would still be one of those creatures. Diamant? She helped kill our father. Why are you making excuses for her? Princess Ivy's not to blame. Her father was. And the fell dragon murdered him. There wasn't even a body left behind. <sighs> Arguing won't get us anywhere. Apologies, Divine One. Princess Ivy, I hope you'll forgive my brother. He spoke out of turn. He didn't speak no, out of turn. Right. He's he's not right, but he didn't speak out of turn. He is just... right to express his emotions and his I can't frustrations. Bear the thought that I'll never see him again, and the ring he spent his whole life protecting. God. We have suffered loss after loss, but the emblems aren't dead. We can still get them back. And we will. I know we will. Alright, plot device. I get... I get... I didn't have all the people... I didn't have all my ring wielders in that battle. It's fine. We, we hand wave that. No big deal. But Vale stole the rings from... The Divine Dragon. She didn't even steal the rings from the people wearing them? Sus. Sus, game. One. You that was still a have great sequence, though. Side. That was absolutely a super fun sequence. That's right. Don't forget about us. Yeah, you too. Lucina, all My far from lost. We can offer our unique strengths as emblems. You can still challenge Obispos. your fate. You don't lose by retreating. Makes a lot of sense but when I you realize, go fuck it. yourself. My mother told Absolutely. me that a divine dragon should never run away. We're not running away. As Lucina said, we're retreating. There's a There's big difference. A difference. <laughs> there is absolutely Time a difference. Time and again, you've shown true bravery, even in the face of daunting odds. But refusing to move on, that's not bravery. It's folly. There's courage. And their stubbornness. Lumera would have taught you the difference. Unfortunately, in your short time together, she didn't have the chance. Perhaps that's why Marth said what he did outside the cathedral. Probably so. Now, at least, I understand. We're not Learning lessons away. too late is We're stepping back. human. Gathering our strength for the next battle. Yeah. I'll become a better fighter. A better leader. I'll make sure no one, not one more person, loses their life under my command. And I'll bring back our friends, the emblems. What do you say, everyone? Are you with me? I'm going to laugh you know when there's I a am. fight sequence later on with armies up. and people are dying in droves. And I'm just be like, she said lost. she wasn't going to let anyone die. And now you have hope. I will stand with you too, Divine One. I will help too. If you'll have me. <sighs> Thank you, everyone. Fucking headgear. Now, to the Queendom of Psalm. Stay with me, and I promise to keep you safe. Yeah. That was a pretty fucking intense series of events. Very, very fun interactions. Uh, re really cool. Sucks to lose the emblems that we lost, but we'll get them back in due time. Um, hell yeah. I'm really looking forward to where the fuck this goes. Having a tennis racket strapped to your face is an odd fashion choice. It is, isn't it? It really, really is. <laughs> All right. That is going to have to be the end of this video. It is very...
Hey everybody, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, consider leaving a like, commenting, or subscribing. It really helps me out. If you'd like to see me live, head over to my Twitch at twitch.tv forward slash the distant horizon.